English 101 asks them to look at some of the larger organizational frameworks and also ask students to find their, their own voice. So to, uh, to find their own identities as a writer, a writer in college, an educated writer. In 101, a lot of the text was more open to interpretation. It was more of an individual paper. It wasn't just, this is what the teacher wants to know. It was, show me what you can get out of this. It's a, not just a difference in the amount of work, but it's a difference in the quality and the kind of work that, that you do when you come here. So in other words, your papers are going to be longer than five paragraphs. They're going to be, um, the logic involved in the papers is going to be more complex and not so, so rigid and so limited. Well, in 101, you'll learn that you have habits about the way you write, just like you can have habits about any other exercise you might do. And it's really hard to break those habits. And you'll, you'll resist, just like I hated revising. That's what I would resist. But um, learning about them, then you realize what changes you need to make to develop yourself as a better writer.